coverage your favorite podcast. I'm Manny Mue with Larly. We got some special guests in the house today. Hello. Hey guys. Oh my God. I'm so excited. Okay, we have Adam. Hi. And Louis. That is Ferra. You guys are so <laughs> excited to be here. I'm so excited to have you guys on. Like, I feel like we're in our guest era right now. Hey. Oh, we're in our guest hey. era. Hey. It's hey. so yes. fun. Because it's like, yes. we love doing it. Like, I mean, even when we do it like ourselves, like it's fun. But like, there's something about having a guest yeah. on or a guest mm. that is just so like, exciting because we get to talk yeah. to you guys yes. about yeah. something. I feel like even we were hella excited because we're like, oh my God, we're all going to get to just like have a conversation and bounce off each other. Yeah. Yes. We've never done something like this together. So we're like, oh my God, this <gasps> Wait, is you guys haven't done like a podcast no. together? No. Okay, so I noticed like, you guys are. Oh. Super. Y'all are popping our cherry. I love yes. it. I'm doing that shit. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are like, yeah, you guys are pretty close, yeah. huh? Yeah, and that's why like when you guys, um, we're talking about uh, when we were all talking about it. I was just like, wait, this is gonna be like our first time like doing yeah. something together with like more people with us. So mm. Come your own wedding. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, sorry, I'm like, you got all excited. <laughs> I have that effect. Dude. I'm, like, I'm like, do you want to switch sides? <laughs> <laughs> no, um, I like you because like like obviously us being best friends. Yeah. We're like the idea to be able to have two best friends on is we cool. We were like, do we have them on to? Well, we originally we were, wanted yeah. you to book you guys separately, uh-huh. but then we were like, wait, like. Like, we feel like you guys are so close yeah. and we we're like I think it would be like interesting to have them on together because it would just be so good you know because yeah. like, you guys have such great chemistry mm-hmm. I feel like that's the first time I come on a podcast and I'm not nervous same <gasps> oh, we love same. to hear it it's gonna we be love like, to hear we it know y'all's like chemistry as well yeah. and then we know like how we are together so we're like oh it's just gonna be like fun it's Bye. just fun yeah. we just wanna have a good time and just shoot the shit it's like our, our podcasts are like not very structured we just like to it's not and it's not like serious like that like no. we just like have, that's why I call full coverage like we're just like full like we're like we I love that name, by the way like thank the moment you. I saw it thank it's you. a little double entendre yeah. or whatever yeah. Yeah. Right. but it's just like cause yep. we I feel like it's based off of our dynamic yeah. like it's not based off of like it needs to be a certain way it's just like mm-hmm. yo like this is just like our podcast yeah, like it's yes. fun yeah it's, you know, not, it's, it's not that serious it's not that serious it's like, not we don't that really care serious. that much that should be our I don't know like you guys shouldn't have even came and I'm going home we don't care <laughs> like, no, we love you guys, but like, we care. But like, no, just it's like different. Yeah. Thank you so much to Magic Spoon for sponsoring this portion of Full Coverage. You guys, start your new year off right with Magic Spoon. Click the link below to grab a variety pack of Magic Spoon cereal and try it today. Be sure to use promo code FOOL at checkout to get $5 off your order or go to magicspoon.com slash FOOL. And Magic Spoon is so confident in their product, it's backed with 100% happiness guarantee. So if you don't like it for any reason, they'll refund you your money. No questions asked. So click the link down below and use code FOOL to for $5 off or go to magicspoon.com slash fool to save five dollars today so we have to pick different. peaks and pits we're doing peaks and pits first, first. Yeah. i feel like you have one of yours spill it give us something give us a peak okay a peak something I good it. something good <laughs> So this is exciting for me because I wasn't expecting it, but I think um, just having a Valentine's Day this year. Excuse me? Yeah. Like I I didn't think I was going to have one. So I was really like trying to make plans and shit Mm -hmm. because all my friends are taken. Mm -hmm. So I was like, what am I going to do like for Valentine's? But last minute, like I, someone just asked me and I was like, oh my God. So Wait, so how did this happen? Like I, yeah. need tea. I need this fucking full tea. So I basically, someone sent me, I don't want to spill too much, but oh, yeah, someone sent me like a little um, bouquet of like flowers. And I was like, who the fuck sent me flowers? Mm. Because I love getting flowers. Like I love it, love it, love it, love it. Uh-huh. And then I was like, oh my God, who sent me flowers? Maybe like a brand. Like sometimes mm. they'll send you flowers. I, like, a little a, thing I, I would think immediately a brand. Yeah, sure. totally. same. So then I was like, oh cute. I saw the letter, didn't think anything of it. And then it just said, will you be my Valentine? And I was like, oh. I was like, what brand just sent me this shit? And it's kind of like, yeah. bitch, I was gonna get mad. Who did this? I was gonna get mad. But then I obviously saw a name on there and I was like, oh my God. Oh my I was like, I have, I felt like a little girl again, like in middle school, like a somebody asked again. me to be like their mouth. I was like, what the I fuck? I think that's the sweetest way to ask. Yeah. Like, that is such a cute way. Sending you I would, flowers. And like, not expecting, I feel like that's what. Just made me be like, what the fuck? It set you over the edge. Yeah, and oh, I think like, I posted it. Sucked for sure. And my- <laughs> No, oh, bitch, dude. but I posted it and then all my um, my comments were like, oh, bitch, you sent these flowers to yourself. <laughs> or someone's like, let me find out your friends or your sister did it. Literally. So I was like, it was Adam. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, the comments were like, bitch, you know it was Adam. I'm not glad you got them. <laughs> <laughs> no, I imagine this whole time is. Oh my God, you just, no, you show up and there's no one there. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm all dolled up, just wait. Like, you're like, I have a reservation. <laughs> you're like, there's nobody under that name here. <laughs> like, that's like, not that's real. Not yeah. real. Yeah. That's not even real. It's like George Glass. Like, it's not <laughs> okay. it's it's a fake ass name. Not real. <laughs> Don't jinx I it. No, it's really, really cute. Crying. I love that. <laughs> <laughs> that's no. so cute i'm so happy because <laughs> no, no, you've been like single for a long time i have now yeah, like for over now. a year now so you were in a long-term relationship beforehand and now yes. you've been single for a while yeah so like in time goes by world? so slow when oh. you're like single okay. after being in okay. a long relationship yeah, yeah, yeah. It just, like, yeah, I was gonna say, especially that. but yeah so like getting because i didn't have a valentine last year oh. with my friend wait oh. i wasn't done with <laughs> that <laughs> no goes, wait wow. wait I didn't have one, but then they did something for me last minute and did like this whole thing for me. So I was like, oh my God, because they're all in relationships. So I yeah. literally was like getting FOMO, mm -hmm. feeling extra lonely. I had only been single for a few months. And then um, oh, yeah. him and Marlene surprised me with this huge, like fucking full out. Like literally Aww. never had something like that. That's love. And I was like, oh my God. I started crying, huh? I was yeah. being a Chiona. That's so cute. Yeah. It was hella cute because we had went to Disney and I was like, how the fuck are we going to be able to plan it without him like knowing that we're going to ask yeah. him? Right, right. So we had took him to Disney the day of us asking him. And mm -hmm. then I was like, okay, can y'all go to his house right now? His family was in on it and everything. And then oh, like, my God. we got home and he was like, what the fuck? And we weren't even with him when he got home. Yeah. Uh -huh. We were like hiding in his grass and shit. So then we had like pulled up on him when it, as soon as he was unlocking his door and he was like, <gasps> and like, he was just like, <laughs> let me tell y'all though, I was like, so like, my mind was just like trying to process it. And I really didn't know they were doing it. Mm -hmm. That when they pulled up, I thought they were just there to record oh, like right. i don't know what was oh, that right. so i was like they got there and i was like looking for someone i was like the fuck You're like who did but this and it hit me because i looked back at them like really looked at them they looked so happy and i was like oh my god it was oh that so i started crying that is precious yeah. and i'm I not a crier okay. so that's how you know, know that shit wow. i've never seen you cry oh my yeah. god i'm not a crier really either Oh, baby, I'll cry. Me really? I'm, I'm not cry. I'm about to cry today. I'm about to cry. I know, I'm about to cry because of this story. <laughs> I'm real. I'm over here. I know. I'm like, <laughs> I was like, me and you were like, I'm fully totally dead inside. <laughs> For real. Like, I have dry eyes. He's like, well, that was boring. I'm drier. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like, like, less emotional. <laughs> I'll put eye drops in. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's actually really cute. Laura and Tyler have actually uh, sent me flowers for my. We oh, sure oh, have. We sure it's have. Cute. It's very cute, it's and like cute. I feel very like seen. Yes. Yes. I'm, I'm, yes. I've never been in a relationship like my whole life, so I'm very used to like but you're lying. being. I swear, no. I've never. Been, well, I've never had a boyfriend. I've like definitely dated official, like, like situations. Weird. Yes. 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 I've been in situationships like. Last guy I saw, like, we were dating for like two months, but it's just like, where I'm not like, you're my man, <gasps> monogamously, I guess. Mm -hmm. So to me, it's like, so like, I'm like, Valentine's like, oh, it's just like, whatever. Like, yeah, it's yeah. just like another day. Mm -hmm. So when you sent mm -hmm. me, I was like, oh my God, like, it was very yeah. sweet and mm -hmm. very endearing. And yeah. I felt very like, oh my God, like, like I'm, your, I'm the honorary Valentine's because it was right. literally from you and Tyler. Yep. Like, Aww. you're our Valentine. That's right. You're that was you Valentine. and Poopy. Yeah. What was your, oh, yeah. what's your peak, Adam? <laughs> Mine is, uh, okay, well, I'm doing something super exciting that I've ever, like, I've never done before. So I'm hosting at a club this oh, week. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Shut up. And I'm so excited because, like, obviously we go to the club, like, it's fun. And, like, mm -hmm. I always meet people going out. Yeah. But this time people are going there specifically to meet me. Oh, my so it's like, gosh. Bad. It's going to be lit. Yeah. It's going to be I'm lit. Excited. Are you nervous? I, I'm a little nervous because, like, I don't know if I'm gonna like give the girlies what they want to eat. Like, You're gonna get the girlies. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I'm just like, I don't know. I don't want to like underdo it for them, you know? Mm -hmm. You won't. So There's like, no way. Nervous, but I'm but what, what, what club is like, what are you doing? It's like, in Pomona. It's at, it's okay. a, and it's a gay club too. So Ooh, all the girls yeah. and the gays are gonna show up. You literally oh, can't I go wrong. You can't go wrong. You literally yeah. can't go live. wrong. Yeah. Absolutely. That's gonna be the funnest night ever. Oh my God, I love that. So I'm like prepping everything. I'm getting like a party bus. What do you do when you when you host actually? Yeah, we want to know more. So I've never like I've never done that before. I don't know what that is. Yeah, me neither. This is my first time. So it's like I have a 30 minute like meet and greet with everyone. And then I have like a little section and just pretty much party it the fuck up with everybody there so sick like, as fuck yeah so you don't actually have that. to do anything like you don't have to like yeah, I mean, go on the microphone and be like hey oh, guys no, thank yeah. you for having me i'm all doing a performance i love that yeah that's so cool I, I, now i kind of want to host are one. you doing anything for valentine's <laughs> oh, yeah. Dude, okay, it's so bad because like, what did I, do? I don't even know because it happened so fast. Bitch, we're really already did, yeah. like, what the fuck, twenty twenty three? Hello, I know it's gonna be gone. So uh -huh. I was like, I didn't even have time. I don't even think me or my boyfriend asked each other 
How long have I, you and your boyfriend been together? I'm just years. nosy. I'm just oh shit, y'all been years. together a long time. And gay years, honey, that's a decade. I know. That's, yeah. that's, that's twenty. Decade. Yes, that that's part. twenty and gay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's and you twenty know that. and gay. And you know that. I yeah. do know that. Mm-hmm. Ah, you're gay. <laughs> and you know that. <laughs> <laughs> no, literally, because like she has, you have all like gay friends. No, you're literally one. like our Marlene. <laughs> yeah. We have our yes. one girlfriend, and we're like, she lives for the gays, and she's yep. like, I just feel the happiest right here. That's, 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 me. that's why we're like, oh my god, I feel like when a gay a friend fly. group has a Marlene a or like fly. a girl, mm-hmm. yeah. yeah, you're just it's sickening. I don't it's know, you live through her. You just need one in the group. Okay? Yeah, you yeah. do. Need one. Like, and then it's sickening, like how you just said right now, like y'all understand everything that goes on. Y'all know the she knows the tea. Yes, she watches Drag Race, so she. Yes. Like, I, I am through and through. She's I like, that. I only go to gay clubs. A ro- yes. gay clubs. We just that. went to Vegas a few weeks ago and we went to Drag Race oh, yeah. Live. Oh, I saw we that. Oh my Bitch. God, you guys. How was it? Is it? <gasps> no. It was the best you guys Vegas should show hit them seen. up. They'll get you a, you, they'll get you a table. And yeah. like, yeah. like say, yes, they absolutely it's will. They'll imagine. hook you up. No, we want to see it. So, we see like uh, TikToks all the time. We're like, <sighs> no. No, in person, it's like, in insane oh, like mm-hmm. it is insane i almost wanted to cry because i'm yeah. a cry but i was just, it was just like so <laughs> 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 like, 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 it's like it was cute <laughs> no, I was was like, 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 yeah. like when george just went on bitch i was screaming um, like yeah. this one time i don't know where we were at and adam was like kept doing this hyping someone up i forgot we were watching something this bitch started bleeding from his no, thumb no. from how much he was no. snapping I was he was a, like a party bus <laughs> oh yeah <laughs> Like yeah, like, I was like, yeah. I'm like, you know, there's a real death drop. <laughs> no, literally, I was like, hyped the fuck up, and I was like a little drunk, so I didn't even feel my body like hurting <laughs> shit. Up until I like saw some red, I was like, oh. Look, like, I it was recent. I still have the fucking like little mark on here. Oh he, he showed me he was he like Lily and it was like so much blood. I was like, bitch from Snappy. Like, oh my God, who were you yeah. cheering for? I'm not cheering for your mom. Oh, yeah, my mom was on the party. Bus. Yeah. That's okay though. Then we'll okay. accept that. We'll no, you guys have to go to the show. Like for real. It's I know you guys have the best insane. time in your life. It's no, insane. we already gag over on TV, bitch. We're yeah. Right? Exactly. We're like, yeah. Hello. I'm watching like- Production. The production value in that show is crazy. They're dropping from the ceiling and shit. From the fucking- George's was like- She's no, George's like holding on just her wrist what other queens are there Georges Eureka Aquaria Jada wow. Asia Asia is the host host and then that's and Derek Barry and Derek Barry of course doing a Britney, Britney. number oh my just god and it was yeah. literally like yep, yep. that's Britney that's yep. so cool I love when that. she was spinning really on stage good. I'm like that's Britney <gasps> on IG stories like this yeah you know what I mean like you know the exact yeah, yeah. she's twirling <laughs> yep that's so what it was good. it's so good so we have to go Wait, but is it like a like an annual thing or is it like it's all year round? round? It's year round, year and they sometimes round. trade out queens, so like, like other busy, queens can get a break. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but they do like Sick I think name. she said Jada told me because you'll get to meet them after. <gasps> yeah, like no I'm sure because you guys can like hook up with a wild person or so whoever the PR people yeah. are, and they'll let you meet them after. And was telling me they do eight oh. weeks. Holy. We've met George's before, huh? Yeah, she's, I she's had, like, so involved. So yeah. The club that I'm hosting at, she hosted. Oh, no Stop. way. Yeah, and we went. It was when um her season was airing. Yeah. So we went. Oh, they, they were, were just going like, crazy. Oh, my God. Yeah. I we had an ugly living. ass outfit on. That's how I remember. <laughs> <laughs> so Tana, Stop explain that. Give us outfit so details. Look, I had just moved out to LA. <laughs> and I, was, I I moved out here before. Well, I was you're feeling from Texas? Yes. Period. And before, I wasn't even 21. So like going out was like, wait, what? We go out? Yeah. 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 So I was very excited to go out, feeling my oats. <laughs> Bitch, I had the ugliest outfit on. Mind you, he was there. Jenny was there. Uh-huh. Serving love, the fucking looks. Love. We love Jenny. Love we love Jenny. Jenny. And bitch, I show up in a white crop hoodie. <laughs> a it was white, a knitted hoodie. Knitted hoodie. Knitted hoodie. Knitted hoodie. Girl, I know you were hot. No, bitch, I was all everybody's grandma. <laughs> so, and then I have fucking American Eagle. I love American Eagle, but I had to the club, I was wearing blue jeans. You were hot, baby. You were hot. It's just like, you know, like when people go out to the club, you kind of wear like darker clothes. Yeah, 100%. You kind of like. A little like, more risque, a little more fun. Yes, yeah, a little sexier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We all look like we're going to go to the coffee. Adam's a brunch. <laughs> Adam like, brought the walker too. He's like this. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I hated it. It didn't look that bad to me until he started capping on himself. Uh, and then, and then like, I was oh, like, yeah, you do look like shit. Where are you wearing? I'm like, ooh. Like, actually, you're not with me today. <laughs> no, but no. I just, it, I didn't And then me. I had some fucking white snow boots on. 
Oh, so you're really <laughs> in the fantasy. You're, you're the fantasy. Oh, you're yeah, straight dude. out of she Colorado. Was she was an Aspen. She thought she was an Aspen. Yeah. <laughs> the locations were confused. Yeah, bitch. It's okay. Me and Manny have dedicated videos roasting our old our red old carpet looks. From the red carpet. Like, so imagine being on the carpet doing that. Yeah, imagine being on a red it's carpet with Getty images with yeah. some of our oh outfits. And that'll never go And knowing away. that those images are out there oh, forever. forever. I'm just kind of like making it worse for you. I'm like, forever. I don't cry, but I'm like. In a sequin romper. In a sequin romper from a boutique no! 19 on the red carpet people the people's event and i'm just like there <laughs> You like go back and like crazy. You know, oh what? God, it was so bad, so so bad. Oh, I didn't yeah, know. I didn't know. I wasn't. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, um, yeah, the mug was right. Give it. Give us the mug was right. Yeah. The mug was kind right. of. The lash was wonky, but <laughs> it was like it was like Gia. It was Gia. Like, sure was. Okay, my peak. Give us something. Um. So last night I went out. Like I went out for like the Super Bowl, did like, the whole fantasy. I went out. I was feeling the fantasy because I was like in like a kind of a short, like kind of crop baseball team. I saw, I saw your video. And I was kind of like very skanky. Like yes. living, I was living and I was like wearing a jock. She was wearing this jock. Yes. <laughs> I saw that. I got hit on like like 10 times. Shut up. And I don't get hit on like that when I go to the club. Like it never happens to me. But for some reason with like the self tan, the uh -huh. like little haircut, like the full fantasy, me really swearing. And maybe when I would bend over to grab something, like yeah, the jock yeah, showing. Yeah, yeah. So he was out there milking it. I was milking it. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, oh my God, oh my God. He was like, oh shit, I just fell. <laughs> yes, no, I was milking it. So I literally got him like 10 times. Wait, I have a question. Cause you went Not pretty early, cute, right? Though. I did. So I do you think that it's late. cause it was like, Daytime. People could have see you, yeah. Because like people want to start, bitch. Okay. Well, at least for me, I feel like you mm -hmm. can't see anybody in there. Everybody's like, like right so here. lit too. By yes. that time, and like at like, nighttime. Oh, so it's maybe like guys were like, yeah. So I went out at like three. Uh, people three were like conscious. I, I was, was out from saying. three yeah. to eleven. Shut up. I was not okay that when I got home. I don't know how I'm here right now. I wasn't well. No. But it was like I did feel like oh I feel cute because I was getting hit on like by people. Maybe because they could see. Yeah. Yeah. Me. So that was and my piece. I'm like, I just felt like the outfit was cute. And, the outfit was, and it's funny because I'm like in a baseball tee for yeah. a football event. I know. Like fully swearing. I'm like, you know, it's the vibe though. Like, yeah. Close yeah. Enough, close it enough. was for the vibe. It was the sporty spice. Yeah. It was the energy. I love that. I love and so that. that was, I didn't get any other numbers because like a lot of them weren't cute, but it was just nice <laughs> to be hit on. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. Even if you're ugly and you hit on me, like you still hit on me. Yeah. <laughs> For real. Like, like anyone, I'm not dead. I'm not dead. But at least like I was approachable. Yeah. Yeah. I love that. At least I love that. He's I'm like, like don't, 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 don't ever look at me again, but thank you. <laughs> oh, yeah, what's your peak? My peak is not guys hitting on me at the club. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, my peak is I'm officially planning a trip to Italy this year. I wanted to go my Ooh, whole life, wow. and every year I'm like, I'm gonna go this year. But you know, yep. that's like a dedicated so trip. Like that is like a lot of time and like yeah. a lot of money a lot of effort and yeah. planning like that so i'm always always putting it off but oh me and tyler God. have finally started planning our trip wow. have so you guys never ever been? never been to italy have you guys Same. ever been to like never, never left before. the country well Mexico. you lie well, just we just went like to mexico yeah, what a few like months ago two or three months ago for a Where'd brand trip go? We to went to Ciudad de Mexico. Mm -hmm. oh. Oh. Okay. And we went for like a little city event. Yeah. Yes. Bitch, the altitude oh is so God. high in Mexico City. The what? The altitude is so high there. I was yeah. like, yeah. yeah. Not well. Well, I'm from Texas, so I was like, I'm used to it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mm. yeah. How long have you lived in LA? Uh, a year and a half. You? Uh, Where going are you two, from? Three years. Uh, you, up north. Oh, yeah, I'm from Watsonville. No yes. So I was already in Cali. Okay, okay. But Oh my god! Just like comparing like oh, it's down so south different. versus it's so it's, like no. almost was a little different apart. state. It was it was in San Francisco you were at uh, near San Francisco. It's called Watsonville. It? Okay, got it. Got but it. it's like an hour and thirty from San Francisco. Yep. Okay, okay, like okay. So I usually Fresno say San Francisco because a lot of people don't know Watsonville. Yeah, yeah. yeah San Francisco. They're like, yeah. Oh, okay, cute. But yeah, so moving down here was like a whole. So I can't oh, even imagine like for Adam. Thing. Oh my god, from Texas. I've been yeah. from Alabama. Oh, my oh God. you too. Hello. She said culture shock when she got yeah, here. Oh, I she bet. said it was spooked her. Oh my God. I said, where are the gay people? <laughs> <laughs> I've been deprived. Oh, I love gay, gay people. people. Where are Lord, I was like, it's I love so the funny. Gays. In Alabama, I knew one guy. He did an internship with Tyler at Hyundai. His name was Abe, and he was a gay guy. We immediately like connected. Clicked. I just loved his ass, and we hung yeah. out that whole summer. But then How he, you loved his ass. I literally <laughs> loved his ass. <laughs> and we clicked, and then I moved out here and just like zero friends of course because came all the way from Alabama I literally didn't know anyone oh and God. I had kikied with a few girls before him but then I automatically was just like drawn I was friends with Patrick very early mm -hmm. on Manny very yeah. early 
Yeah. Like Gabriel was one, Jesus here. That crowd was like my first friends That's out crazy. here. Yeah. It's like me. You've been a girly mm-hmm. ever since. Been but a girly she, you had like since. no gay friends really growing up though, because there was None. no like. At least I'm not, they, sure they weren't there, out. They there weren't were, out. I'm sure there were one or two. It's so they funny. Tyler's best friend in college came out gay. <gasps> yes, no. yes, and we, you, nobody had. You never idea. know because they're we so like. Crazy. Crazy. No, they're yeah. so like you just can't. Your gaydar bitch. does not go off. Say, they like, hide it. They hide it. Thank you so much to Magic Spoon for sponsoring this portion of full coverage. You guys, Magic Spoon is this amazing high quality cereal that is grain free, gluten free, high protein, keto friendly, natural flavors, zero grams of sugar in it. It's really just like the next big thing in cereal. It really is. It's like a reinvented cereal. They have a variety pack. So they have cocoa, fruity, frosted, and peanut butter. Ooh. So they have a bunch of different flavors. My personal favorite, I actually work with them on my YouTube channel, oh. and I got to try out all their flavors. My favorite mm-hmm. is the cocoa. Uh, Absolutely, mm. I love it. I'm a it. huge like cocoa cereal person, so the fact that they have this, and it's, I feel like it's more conscious. Definitely. That I really, really do enjoy the fact that this is like something that I can eat. Because I feel like I grew up and like cereal was like a thing for me. And, like, yeah. And it still is. Well, it has zero grams of sugar and it has 13 to 14 grams of protein and only 140 calories per serving. So some good stuff there. I love it. You guys start your new year off right with Magic Spoon. Click the link below to grab a variety pack of Magic Spoon cereal and try it today. Be sure to use promo code FOOL at checkout to get $5 off your order or go to magicspoon.com slash FOOL. And Magic Spoon is so confident in their product. It's backed with 100% happiness guarantee so if you don't like it for any reason they'll refund you your money no questions asked so click the link down below and use code fool to for five dollars off or go to magicspoon.com slash fool to save five dollars today So whenever I was in high school, his aunt, who is crazy, and I love her to death, but she would like take me clubbing and I'm like 17, 16 years old, but whatever, fuck it, right? So she would take me clubbing and there's this gay club in Alabama. It's like probably one of the only ones called 322. And I had no idea we even had a gay club. I'm in high school. I don't know nothing. She (laughs) takes me out there, sneaks me in because I'm underage, me and my friend who's her daughter. And we get drunk as shit full drag show and I'm talking about I've never even seen men in makeup in like real life yeah. probably like ever drag race isn't on TV right now yeah, you know what I mean is, yeah, this, this is, is a long thing yet, uh-huh. I'm in high school okay yeah. don't do the math anyway <laughs> <laughs> um, and it I was immediately just attracted to it because it was just so different and yes. I hated everything in Alabama like I just wasn't about it like I loved fashion and I loved mm-hmm. a lot of makeup I didn't like wearing just like t-shirts every day you know yeah, what I mean like yeah. I love all that and like gay culture like express that yeah. a lot so I was like kind of attracted to it so that was kind of that I put a pin in that and then moved out here and it's here just like I open dress yeah, like, absolutely oh yeah, I was like oh my god there's more to it and then I yeah. immediately got on stage swear to god but I'm a crackhead you know I'll do it <laughs> <laughs> you know, she's a girl I'll do it like don't bring me up there. I'm like, Wait, okay. you ever Bitch. I I've run the streets. I know. I'm surprised I, you haven't seen me out. But if girl. she's ever been out, she's usually with me in. And we have. That's like the uh, only place it. I'll go out dead serious. Mm-hmm. I don't really like the straight clubs here. Yeah, but you know the gay clubs are like outside of just the gay thing. They're just so much fun. Yeah. Yes. And like though, I've seen a comment that like they'll tell you like, oh, I always see Adam at WeHo, but like, bitch, I feel safe Same. there. I get that. Oh, me too. Too. Like it's just like girls are like, People will like say shit about it, but like I'm the same way as you. Where like I grew up, I feel like there was little to nothing out there, especially for me. Mm. So once I moved out here and I saw WeHo, I was like, oh my god, I feel not only seen, accepted, comfortable. Yeah. I can wear like the most hota outfit mm-hmm. and feel comfortable. Totally. Yep. But bitch, I go to a straight club. And if, even if I probably wearing a this, look, a I'll look. be like, no, we've gotten no, declined. We've gotten oh, declined yeah. getting into a club because of how we were dressed. Or we get hate crimed, or it's just like, yeah. so people are like, bitch, you're always 100%. here, but I'm like, sorry, I feel safe. Like, I didn't yeah. have this before. Absolutely. Not only that, but like, Everybody there is already like you're familiar with everybody. Everyone's so nice. You see like the girlies out there; they're being yes. nice. Like everybody, I don't know. It's, it's you cool. get like a cadence to it. Like you have yeah. like your regulars that you see, and you're like, "Oh my yes. god, hey girl, how have you been?" Yeah. The thing is, too, like I, it's such a strange like thing because a lot of straight people are now flocking to like the gay areas. Yeah, and like a lot of straight people are coming in. Like we were just talking men about and women that. like coming mm-hmm. in, yeah. not saying anything because I love when you're with me. Oh no, 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 I, I don't take any. Like don't take offense to this, but like it's it is kind of strange because the. WeHo is so like made for the gays because mm-hmm. we were not accepted by the exactly. straight. It's like let areas. us let you guys have it's like something. let us have something, something because a lot of the times like they will. 
be like really wild at the clubs or like they're, they're the ones that are causing fights or like the yes. swing people oh my and god i'm like girl Tell this isn't it. even there like this doesn't happen and we all like we're just trying to live and like feel like free in some way yeah. and so we built this for ourselves yeah. Yeah. and then when people come into it you're like damn like can we have something? Because if yeah. we go to the gay, the straight clubs, you're Bitch. gonna make sure you like oh, we know that you want to know. That's they don't even let us go into the restroom. Sure. Yep. No, let they're me tell you. It, sure. Tell them. Bitch, um, tell us. Tell us. Write it in the book. It's just like a, like look what you were saying. So say like Laura, you go with them. It's different because she's, well, she's part with of us. like the gays. She's yeah. with she knows. Us. Yeah. But it's totally. like you see like. And again, I'm not talking shit to like the straight people, but it's just when they bring that energy because mm -hmm. there'll be like a groups of like straight people there. Mm -hmm. Totally. Last time we were there, we were walking and some guy. I don't know if he was calling him or me, but all I hear is fucking faggot at WeHo inside of Mickey's. Yeah. Wow, that person really doesn't want to live very long. And I literally, no, I literally turned around and I was like, you're in WeHo. What? And he meant it. Like, you know, it's like if you're joking with your friends, you like yeah. call someone, like oh, for you're playing sure. around. But bitch, like, and I turned around and be like, is this dude being for real? And then there'll be groups, like last time he was by the bar, this guy and this girl were like making out hardcore mm -hmm. and they start pushing the fuck out of him. Oh my God. Because literally. we were trying to get by and he was like, excuse At me, the bar, blah, blah. And the guy was like, waiting in line to get exactly what you but were they were saying. alone. What I'm like, saying. like we thought they were like, oh, maybe they're here with like a group because you know yep. it's different but yep. no they were like really trying to like fight and yeah. i was like and i was like me? bitch what the fuck it gives like, like homophobic but i'm like you're totally. like, but you're like why are you they're in your house exactly. yeah like that's how i feel and i'm like it's like why are you the call, you hang from the call, call you can't is even yeah. <laughs> no, literally. Literally. Call the house. House. so that's why i get frustrated because i'm like if i see a group of like women and straight men together and they're all there going and, and to the gay club i'm like why can't you do that at the straight club? Like that's yeah. like, imagine like, so I think I saw like the statistic about like how in the world only like six to eight people identify as LGBTQ plus, uh -huh. eight eight percent of people and 92% identify as wow. hetero. So it's like, imagine how little we have yeah. in comparison to so much. But that is true. Cause like, we're in a bubble right here. We're like look at when we we're see not, all this. cause we're not from LA. Look yeah, at you yeah. guys realize like when you're not in it, like I didn't yeah, even have a first know, experience LA. until I was like a it's teenager, crazy. you know? Yeah. But you don't think that because yeah. we're around it's you people the all the time. Yeah. We're used to it. But the thing is like, imagine how little it is. So when straight people come into a space that like, they're already dominating the rest yeah. of the world. Like, can we just have like yeah. something? Yeah. And, like, and honestly, like, hell yeah, come out, spend your money, like, keep the economy flowing, yes. but don't be weird about like, it. That's at literally the club. It. Like, don't yeah. be an asshole. Like, more than happy, like, if they're there and Absolutely. they're being nice or, be you up, or even at least just being respectful. But yeah. when it's like they're being a dick about it, I'm like, Girl, it's the only time we want to yeah. like feel safe. We're not the only space we have. Totally. Kind of. Absolutely. I'm like, totally. I don't, I don't want to go get fucking. It's even the bashed. vibe too. It's like, I'm sorry, but it's like gay clubs is like kind of for gay people yeah. to yes. like do yes. their thing uh -huh. and like yeah. live you don't their... get the same vibe going to it's a straight club not the like, same it's, it's vibe different. yeah and that's why i don't like to go because i'm just not interested because like a lot obviously people go to the club to hook up or meet people yeah. or hang right. out and like i'm not interested in any of those yeah. things i'm mm -hmm. just interested in getting drunk and having fun with my friends yeah, exactly. yeah, yeah. so the gay club is like perfect because all mm -hmm. my friends are gay people yeah. so yeah. it's but it makes just sense like great with us yes and of course of course but if it's like a whole group of straight people going there just to like Get away from their straight place. I'm like, no, yeah, go yeah, back. Yeah. Like, or yeah. to much worse, rag on. Or be hor yeah, or horrible. Or that's there, like a like, whole nother layer to it, right yeah. there. Like that's, that's just horrible. It's, yeah, and it's scary. it really is. <laughs> it is scary. Absolutely. That I was, was like, let's go to we home. <laughs> <laughs> We're like, so we're talking about. <laughs> we're like this bitch right here. <laughs> <laughs> we're like, where are your gay friends? <laughs> yeah, we need to go through the clothes. Where are your gay, where friends? Are your gay friends? How many gay friends do you have? With <laughs> you right like, what now? are their names? Yeah. Yeah. Especially at the Abbey bitch. The Abbey That's has what we so don't many straight yeah. people now, yeah. and it's like, oh. damn it's girl, scary. it's like it's all straight people. Yeah, mm. Mm. like, like they are like, I don't know. It's just so weird. It is. It is. What was your pit? Your pit? Oh shit! See, we trail. Yeah, we, we trail. are trailers. This podcast works. I'm like, well, it looks like we're out of time, you guys. Lovely. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, my pit. What is my pit? I, what is? <laughs> my pit? Right here. Right there. Yeah. <sighs> fuck, fuck, fuck. You say yours. Yeah. You say okay, mine. Okay, my pit is I don't have a Valentine's this year. <gasps> Then what? We still have a few. I'm used to it though, girl. Wait, wait, we have one day to make it happen. Wait, I have, wait, I have one, one day. day. You know what I was thinking about? Like, honestly, low key, I was thinking about asking this guy to be like my Valentine because we've hung out twice. Oh, but like, I feel like it's low key like friend vibes. Like I've but, gotten friend but vibes. That could like, be something. Literally, this is my best thing when it's come to dating. Uh -huh. You can't look for a relationship or right. force 
or force a friendship to like maybe be a it's just like just go and it it's helps with your energy. nerves too 100%. just help go into it with like a friendship yep and then if it's vibing you're both gonna start feeling like oh wait i'm like maybe feeling something and it turns into something rather than like mm. like what you said right now if you yeah. stop yourself because you're like if i like ask him and it's like not the vibe is you're yeah. never gonna do it but it's like no even if he's like just friends mm -hmm. just do it as friends and if you guys start catching in a vibe then just make out See, yeah, i like that i like that but you it's should. like it, it, and if it doesn't you hung out with a cool friend so whatever because yeah. that's See, what that's, i was gonna do that's, that's a win-win win. yeah you guys together so, <laughs> yes, See, yes. Do you know my actual issues is like i i have a hard time differentiating like friendship and like liking you i think mm. all gay guys i have that. i it's really, really struggle and it's been for a long like for a long my whole yeah. life like i've struggled with it because yeah. it's like i don't especially if you're single and i'm attracted to you i'm like are yes. you my friend or do i like you yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. i don't know and, and it's like i'm like am i wasting my fucking time even being your friend because i'm gonna like you eventually yeah i feel you yeah what's the point you know what i yes, think it is weird because i i feel that way all right we're all in fucking therapy right now better help i was just gonna say i feel like well, I don't know if you had like um, trauma the same, yes. like when we were younger you don't really have a lot of friends your friend mm -hmm. group's really small you don't have somebody else who's like either openly gay or like mm -hmm. someone you can talk to so when you finally have that we have that like confusion of like do I like you or you, do mm -hmm. I like you as a friend yeah mm -hmm. like it's always like you don't know how to go about this well that would be like maybe a best friend for like a straight man yeah, why oh. and you're like, like wait what, what would I, I do with oh, that yeah. you know what I mean like See, that would be really that hard way, it's like, to blur yeah. the lines yeah. that would be so hard oh my god yeah. that, I just know but see Hello. like in the gay community obviously you guys are friends with each other so it's like blurs the lines a little bit it's a or little even like on the uh, like looking at it from the outside a lot of people with, what used to think me and Adam were dating. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Even though he has a full-on relationship and yeah. is open about it, mm -hmm. people are like, wait, are you guys dating? How? I'm like, you're together. So yes. Like, like, yes. Like, you guys. I feel like if you hang around gay people enough, I have for years, it's uh -huh. like, I know you guys aren't dating. I can tell you guys yes. don't yeah. date. Like, yes. I know. Mm -hmm. But like, if you haven't, you just assume. Yeah, but like, if like, you like funny. know gay people, I can like see you guys hang out. I know you're not yeah. dating. You can see like, Oh, you're my sister. I can tell relationships yes. and I can tell whenever there's something. Uh, there's something brewing. I know. <laughs> oh, shit, no, I was trying. Trying. <laughs> we were fucked. We're not even gay. Um, <laughs> the whole night. I'm like, we're like, can I get a thumbnail? I'm like, don't be a fool. I'm like, the show's canceled. I'm gonna have to tell somebody about this. <laughs> we're gonna cut that in a second. I'm like, I'm like, he's sleeping. He's like, wait, he wakes up his eyes. He does all the time. The way you screamed as soon as you did. I was like, we're gonna have to clip that for the podcast. I'm sorry, that shit was so funny. I know, but I was gonna break the whole thing. I hit my head on this every episode. Shut up. I do. I know, and I had already hit it, but in the beginning, I laughed and nobody noticed. I was like, okay, let me just watch out for a bit. Maybe we should move the show. Oh, you wanted to sit there. Oh, oh, you see the next episode of our show. Oh, don't oh, like, okay, what's your pet? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I like the shelves. <laughs> the shelves. Honestly, the shelves. The shelves. My okay. pit. Yeah, give us something. Okay, Besides the fact you just knocked yourself out. I know. <laughs> like, <let me> think. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, uh, I think my pit is not having nails. Oh. Really? No, Wait, so why I, do you not want them? It's because, so I'm getting surgery. Oh, oh yes. Yeah. Me. Yes, you were telling so us. I was, uh -huh. I was, I'm going to get surgery. So I was like, I can't have any nails, obviously, whenever I go under the knife. So I was just going to not do it. I have surgery like totally. in like almost three weeks. Uh -huh. Are you nervous? Yeah. How do you I'm feel? more excited than okay. nervous. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That should have yeah. been my peak. That should no, be my peak. No, that's your peak. I like it that you were going to say that. It's a combo. It's a combo. It's it a combo. Yeah. Peak and pit. I have a peak and a pit. Harry. It's a peak and a peak. So, yeah, I don't have any nails right now, but it's because, so I get my nails, right? And I get them, like, as long as Louis has his right now. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And I never take breaks. Like, wow. you, you I will have them. the thinnest, most mm -hmm. brittle fucking nails ever. And I'll just be like, can you, you put You said put an acrylic on it. Add more. Add a stone, too. Add a So, it's because I feel like if they're so thin and fucked up, just cover them up. Like, right, right, to right. protect them. Uh, <laughs> sure, okay, girl. <laughs> Something like that. I have yeah. tissue paper under yeah. here. Yeah. 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 Tissue paper. So... Um, I don't have them and now I feel weird like people are like how do you do shit with your long nails I'm like I get them so often and so long do you guys ever get sick of people asking you that yes, yes. Uh -huh. no matter how how many times I've posted my nails yeah. it's the same thing over it's like girl over. 
I'm like, you know, and at this like, point, I don't even wipe. I'm just, yeah. <laughs> yeah like, I have a fucking bidet. Yeah, 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 I'm like, I just don't even do anything about Some it. Some people get so mad, too. I, like, I, they're so pressed. Like, the they're fact having that, like, to wear the nail. Yeah, like, yeah, they're like, wearing the nail. Yeah. Why the fuck are your nails that long? I'm yes. like, yes. Okay. Are you good? Yeah. I'm are you like, good? Because I want to. I know. I know. What's wrong with that? So, yeah. <laughs> this is pretty. I know. Wait, so why do you have to have no nails for your surgery? Isn't it like um, a, not a cleanliness, why? but like bacteria yeah. or like something that, like that? And like, really? I feel like they I have to that. put like that little thing on your finger oh, when you're like doing shit. stuff. So like, they cut <laughs> something like that. <laughs> they just cut that one now. <laughs> you're like, oh, I'm on full sale on your surgery. <laughs> 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 they they get the, the bone saw. <laughs> 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 I wake up and my ears are gone. Uh, 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 no, girl. bitch. Yeah, that's so funny. That no. was my pit one week when we did the Josh and Sebastian episode. Mm-hmm. My was I didn't have nails on. Oh yeah, and I was like, I don't want, I don't want to have nails. nails. It's like an accessory. Yeah. It just is. It's Once like you lash. have them for long enough and then you take them away, it feels like you're missing half your finger. Literally, and, and then like, you feel your fingertips. It's so sensitive. It's, 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 it's like it you start texting and it like hurts. Yeah, or and then when you don't have nails, like for like even a week and then you get them done your nails are so sore oh, oh yeah. my god fingers. Oh, i, I can't even hurts. like shower because i'm yes. like oh. they're it's rough so too sore. Well, they i just got rough. i went like what six months without nails that's yeah, the longest i've gone so this is, is this the this is my fresh. first in like six months <gasps> and i woke up and i forgot that i got my nails done oh my god my fingers hurt no. so fucking yeah. i was literally like ow like i, they had, I had them under my blanket mm-hmm. so i was just like what the fuck and then yeah. i forgot yep and I was like, even when you press down you're like or bump it's anything. Like I'd be like, why do you get them then? <laughs> I know. <laughs> They're all the trouble. No, you guys, Laura did my acrylics once. <gasps> Let's have that conversation, Laura oh Lee. Oh my God. So no. For a video we did, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna wear my nails for 24 hours, but oh Laura's gonna put the acrylics on me. Like, she had an acrylic set from Amazon. Yeah. So Laura puts the acrylic set on me. It was the worst you guys, acrylic you've ever seen. It was like a platypus. Like, <laughs> like, a, like, a, duck, like a duck bill. Like, it was like, and those bubbles in it. No. I was like, what the fuck? And I was driving and I had them on and I was like, this is crazy. Yes. I was like so spooked. Right? And I remember turning and I went like this and I hit the nail against. Oh my God. Like, it ripped your you real guys, nail up. Oh. Uh, I screamed yes. in my car. I was like, I can't believe like, I, this is horrible. Like, for me, like it was, I've never, I've Horrific. only ever just like had normal nails, like mm. bit my nails. Mm. And mm-hmm. I was spooked. Yeah. I couldn't believe it. I was like, this is, you're strong for doing this. Yeah. You get used to it. Yeah. And then yeah. Like, you can't live without them. And then, yeah. Mm-hmm. And then, no, I've never, ha- I've seen horror stories. Actually, I have. Like where a girl's nail will like rip oh, completely the off. real nail off with it. And I'm like, <laughs> yep. that would be like my 13th reason. That's bitch yeah, that's the fighting. Yeah. The fighting girlies. And then I hate when these fucking girlies, when that happens, they post it on their story and they're like, oh, my nail's gone. Like, oh, <laughs> that's me. I'm and you're like, like don't show me that. Please put a trigger warning. <laughs> 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 we will throw up. Yeah. You're the TWs. Yeah. You're the trigger warning girlies. Because yeah, yeah, right. right. you kind of know it's what that I would feel it. like. So you're like, uh-uh. Oh, it grosses me out. And then like I see the blood. I'm like, mm-hmm. and then I don't want to get my nails done. It's just, ugh. I've never broke. I've only had one one incident like that and I had fell. So I like, I was drunk. and You landed. I landed on two of them. Ooh. I was like, oh. I'm actually like this. It's yeah, the ground like, like that. Oh. I was trying to get oh. oh. And there was stiletto this. So I was like, oh, oh. get on heels. Bitch. I'm the walk like this. I'm like, bitch. On the grid. She's like, oh. you're on the corner of the grid. Like, oh. Get back up with them. He's like, for real. I'm like, they're like, oh, my oh shit. <laughs> You what? I'm like this with my glass. <laughs> <laughs> you may go a little guy. I put my name on it. Like this is mine. <laughs> I hate you. Oh my god. Wow, um, we just took it there. Okay, we just took your it there. pit. My pet. I was mm-hmm. trying to think of like a really, really good one, but my life was kind of boring. So. Or you could- <laughs> Well, listen, my, or I, I, I have a pit now. Well, mine's stupid too. But like, okay. it's just like a lame one, but I'm doing this new thing because <laughs> I'm learning. I'm getting old now and I'm getting wrinkles. So everyone's like, just sleep on your back. Like it will change your life. You sleep on your back. Stop sleeping on your face. Cause they're like, if you sleep like that for <laughs> yeah. eight hours, nine hours, 10 hours sometimes. Just keep that in here. But um, it's like one of the main, call, besides the sun, causes of wrinkles, yeah. how you're sleeping on your face, or mm. you can like deteriorate, deteriorate one of your cheeks down, which oh. I've already done. And I've had to get oh, I thought you were gonna say, which I can see. I know. <laughs> <laughs> 
you know, seeing us. <laughs> you look at the camera, you can see. She's like, Imagine. you sleep on your left side. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> you sleep on both sides, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> I just sleep on the pillow like this. <laughs> you don't breathe, do you? You sleep face down, you? Like, you sleep on your lips. <laughs> oh my God, I'm gonna cry. Hey, okay, so what are you guys doing? I'm trying, so they tell you to sleep on your back so it all just like snatches up. So I'm in the process of trying to learn how to sleep on my back, which is horrible. I it's horrible, that. I can't, I can't. It's horrible. Can you sleep I, on your back? It's like a comfy home. It is. Bitch. I'm a side sleeper. Okay. Me too. Ask Adam how all the different positions okay, you look, yeah, Wait, can please I tell, tell about me. the one story? <laughs> please do. To start it off. Please. Adam sleeps in the most funniest ways ever. <laughs> One time we had came back from the club. It was super, super, super late. His boyfriend crashed on my couch and Adam was having a conversation with me and he was sitting on one of my, um, <laughs> what are you called? Like the little Marston? bar stools? So like no handles, nothing. It's just a stool. We're having a phone conversation. He starts falling asleep and he falls asleep like this. <laughs> No, not leaning on anything he's just like him for like this Damn. so then i'm like okay so i leave him bitch i come back down like was eight hours sleep later and he's still like this eight hours? <laughs> bitch. bitch i woke up so sore i was like, like really <laughs> he was like oh <laughs> Literally, I'm like, how did you not fall? I was like, like, massage just... it up. <laughs> oh no. my god! So look, whenever, no, in high school, I would literally. So I had a bed that had like a huge, like, what are those things called? Like board. Uh huh. Okay. Headboard. Bitch, a headboard. <laughs> so I would sleep with my head on the headboard. <laughs> Bitch, I kid you, like I would be like this. <laughs> and I'm like, that's why I'm used to the head. I have a <laughs> like, like this. I'm like, that was comfortable like, for me. So, comfortable. <laughs> so I would literally sleep and like to the point where I would I got like a huge black mark on my face. No. <laughs> I go to school, pressure, like, I I breeze death. Death. <laughs> no, when I first moved out to LA, I hadn't done it for a while. So I, I remember sleeping. <laughs> and you missed it. <laughs> no, I did. You missed so, it. It was like, ah. I did it. <laughs> Bitch, the next morning I woke up, my forehead was like this. I was like, hello? <laughs> I had its own gravitational pull. Oh. Oh, <laughs> it was all blocking from the sun. <laughs> it had <I> sonar. Like, <laughs> I'll plug my phone in. <laughs> it's all charged right It's away. all charging right here. Like this. <laughs> <Girl>. <laughs> imagine. This episode of Full Coverage is sponsored by Every Plate. So you guys want to save money on food this year? Then check out Every Plate. Every Plate is America's best value meal kit, and it's 25% less cheaper than grocery shopping. And with the cost of eggs going up and up, saving a bit of money on groceries sounds like a great deal. While takeout is super easy, eating out can also get super expensive. The Every Plate meals are 58% cheaper than ordering pickup. Plus, sometimes it's nice to have a home cooked meal. I personally love a home cooked meal, and I feel like Every Plate just makes it so easy. But besides the great food, my favorite part about every plate is that it actually teaches you how to cook. It's getting you in the kitchen, working on your knife skills, learning what spices and ingredients go together. Like I actually feel like a pro when I'm trying to make these meals, which is crazy because I actually cannot cook to save my life. So this makes it like so much easier. It's fantastic. So to get a meal kit with the same deliciousness at a much lower price point, get started with every plate for just $149 per meal by going to everyplate.com slash podcast and entering code FULL149. Get $1.49 per meal by going to everyplay.com slash podcast and entering code FULL149. Okay. Oh my God, I'm not okay. We took I mean, it I the giggles, fuck. We love to take it there. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay, I love that. I don't know where we went with that. But, but yeah, so you're sleeping on your back. I'm sleeping on my back. That's all I know. And it's hard. So it's it's it is hard. It's annoying. Because every five minutes, I wake up and I'm on my side again. Yeah, <laughs> it's been like five hours She's fast. Like, I'm like, damn it. it. <laughs> 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 Sometimes I'm like, let me pull my cheek back and then it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like getting it prepared. Like drag tape. <laughs> Sleeping. She has a wig on. <laughs> I'll her for no reason. A little bonnet. Yes. So I was like, what are you doing? You're like going to bed. <laughs> You're in full drag. <laughs> full drag. What is your pit? Rupa. Now you thought of it. Okay, mine, the reason I say it's boring is just because like, 
it's like everyday life things but i can never like have my house like clean mm. and i've been trying well no no no. i don't want people to think that i'm a messy ass girl messy it's whore. just messy but not dirty there you it's go a messy uh-huh. girl. It's, I'm messy. it's like my my room or my beauty room those are the only two my whole house is clean i promise you guys mm. but every time like i'm hitting the weekend or it's like events coming up oh, i'm that girl. girl that will try on clothes and i start throwing everything because i'm running late and then it becomes a mess destroy an entire yes. home mm-hmm. so this weekend i was supposed to like clean but then I ended up just making a bigger mess because I started like <laughs> decluttering my closet. So now there's oh. more clothes and I'm like, Ugh. So now so, you're living in it. Yeah, right mm-hmm. now it's very much like I go to bed, mm-hmm. I just push everything to the side. Oh my God. Like, oh, yeah. I'm like that too. So but it's, then it's I'm also therapeutic like when you when it gets like that yes. and then you just fix it. Yes. That's like, what I like. That's what I like. That's like the, what's it called? It's like the, the positive. Type A personality. Or, uh, the pit or the peak. Virgo. Yeah. Very Virgo. Wait, what's you guys the signs? <gasps> yes. Yeah. Oh, uh, let me think. Let me think. Fuck, let me think I don't know. Think. I'm not going to You could possibly be Pisces Leo, Pisces okay. Leo. You could be Ashley Bottom. <laughs> <laughs> Top bottom. Virgo. Virgo is you. Virgo. Virgo. Mm. Virgo. What are you? <laughs> oh, I'm even. a boy. <laughs> <laughs> he, her. I'm a Taurus. Okay, Taurus. I know a lot of Taurus. I like Taurus. I I'm a Leo. Oh, I knew, knew it. She's like, get out. <laughs> get out. I'm gonna hate you. Her mom, sister, niece, all of them. They're Leos. Really? Yeah, Leo yeah, yeah. I love Leos. Leos. I, like I have a lot of Leos in my life. I'm a Virgo. Louis is my first Aries. Leo in my life. <gasps> Twenty. When's your birthday? April fourth. I'm April twenty first. Oh my oh, gosh, I love you that. guys! You're literally like right there. Yeah, I'm so Aries. close. Uh, not all of us can be so lucky. Yeah. <laughs> 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 not all of us can be so lucky. Like, was that shit? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, oh. wait, what are you again? Virgo. Uh, oh, I love Virgos. No, Everybody favorite. that I like have a huge amount of love for is a Virgo. <laughs> you're like my favorite sign. Well, you're Louis is my first Leo. In my life. I like Leo's. I Leo's too. have strong personalities. Mm-hmm. Leo, you have a strong personality. Mm-hmm. And that's a good thing. In a good way. That's yeah, a good, a good thing. Um, I now. was raised by that. He's just waiting. I was so big for me. I don't know. I'm like, I'm like. Louis Castro. He starts reading us. Louis Castro. That's a strong personality. Not Louis Castro. not going to get you far. Not Louis Castro. Oh, my God. The library's open. How'd you guys meet? Yeah. Okay. How'd you guys meet? I'm crazy. Well, so I was like, How? <laughs> He's a grinder. a grinder. Yeah. No, you're yeah. lying. It's because we were both no. single at the time. Okay, T. So I don't know. We obviously, like, how was you just like? Did you guys know each other from like online? Well, yeah. Obviously, I'm I knew Louis. <laughs> we're just kidding. I fucking can't stand them. <laughs> we're lying. <laughs> I mean, we could usually we usually can go about it so long. Well. I was like, where are we but gonna take this story? Like, I was like, wait, are we gonna no, continue? I was like, what? Doing that. Just like, I know. We should say grinder. We should say grinder. Yeah. Yeah. We like our friends know us because I ah, didn't know us only that. No, they hate when we do that. We literally will show a full story, like yeah. play it out so well. Everyone and we're fully like, believes it. And then we're like, we're just <laughs> <kidding>. <laughs> oh, dude, literally. And they're like, great. Like we just made up, wasted a whole fucking ten minutes <laughs> telling the story. And they're like, so no part of it was real. Straightest face. Yeah. So we're like, you're like, well, we had fun. <laughs> no, I well, I knew Louis before, like I was on social media. Mm-hmm. I was always a fan, still am. Mm-hmm. And then us we too, met. We met. He was the one of the first people who followed me on TikTok. Never, oh. I was like going doing Rosa, mm-hmm. and I sc- I have it screenshotted on my phone. He till showed this day. me. I was like, oh what the fuck? So, so um, cute. yeah, we kind of just met up because we. Well, I obviously loved his content. Like, I love him as a person. So I was like, I want to be friends with Louis. I want to be friends with Louis. So I remember one of the first times I came out to... I was in Vegas. Wow. And I was like, why did I go to Vegas? I should have just went to LA. Like, it's... Like, I was, I had just had my gastric bypass. I couldn't even drink. Mm. So I was like, wait, why don't I just go to LA? So I was going to LA. I was already friends with Marlene. And Marlene mm. had hung out with Louis a few times mm-hmm. already. Mm. So I was like, it'll be cute. Like, if we have, like, a little dinner. Like, whatever, whatever. So that was, like... Uh, the first time we had hung out like in person we got super drunk we had we went to a restaurant got so drunk we ended up going to Louis' house after oh. yeah like that's how comfortable I don't like take people to my house like that mm-hmm. especially at that time but I was just like I felt the vibes and I was like you guys want to go to my house so yeah. then I brought them oh, that's so cute. I love that. but I love that. from my side I had seen like Adam's videos on TikTok and I always thought he was like super funny so funny but I was like, oh my god, I want to know like what his humor is like, because I already feel like I, I related to his humor on TikTok, but you know, there's like guys, so much more. I mean, you're so different online, but mm-hmm. you guys have a similar yes. like, yeah, like you guys don't take yourself that serious. Yeah, you know what and I mean? that's like, why I feel like I was so like there. drawn yeah. to. Him. I was on love. Yeah, no, but I was just like, I want to meet this bitch in person. So yeah. every time he was out in LA, I would like try to hit him up, or we would try to make it work, but 
our schedules just never aligned. Yeah. And then when he came to Vegas, uh-huh. I was like, I was genuinely really excited to meet him. Cause I was like, oh my God, his humor seems like it matches mine. It does. And humor is like the way to my heart, bitch. Like yep. in a relationship and a friendship and anything, I love anyone who can make me laugh. Yeah. So when we hung out for the first time, I literally was gonna pee myself. Yeah. I was like, I haven't met somebody who can make me as much make me laugh as much as he made me laugh. And then we bounce off each other's jokes a lot. Yeah. So like uh-huh. I don't know, it's just from that one time we hung out. He eventually moved out here. So I moved out here because I came to his party. He had like thrown a party. Mm. And I was, I had just like signed for an apartment in San Antonio right before I flew out here. Oh, no way. And then I came to the party. It was the first ever like event that I went to as like an influencer. So Mm -hmm. I was like, everybody that had ever watched or like liked a picture on Instagram was there. Mm -hmm. So I was like, oh my God, it was so (laughs) cool. So then that weekend Mm -hmm. that I was here, my manager was like, why are you not like moving out here? And I was like, I don't know. <laughs> I had no like nothing like holding me back in Texas. Like yeah. my family's there, but I can like just go back and forth with totally. visiting. So I told my boyfriend, I was like, why aren't we moving out here? So I thank Louis all the time for literally like mm. if it wasn't for his party, I would have never like that the thought of me moving out here would have never Everything came. happens for a reason. Yeah. yeah and it like, worked out. Unfortunately, I was single a little bit right after that. And I was like, mm. if I didn't have Adam there, I was like, I feel like I would have gone insane. It's like perfect. Like I have my family and I'm so thankful for them, but like a good having friend a friend is different, with. you know. Yeah, it's so I feel like totally. it just worked, and we just had like our what our one year anniversary, like a few I know, days ago. Yeah, literally, it like, feel like you've been friends forever bitch, though. When literally. we saw yeah. it, it showed like it was like a year ago, right? Yeah, and the snap wow. thing popped up, and we we're in my house, and we're like, bitch. So we looked at like one of the first pictures we took together. Oh yeah, right. It was crazy because we were kind of like in a distance. We yeah, were, like, we're like, <laughs> and then we like look at pictures for an hour. Like, yeah, literally. But like, I feel like in our like time span of our 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 relationship, our friendship, it's like we've done so much together, like. I've already met his like ha- basically his whole family. Mm. He's met my family. I took him to my hometown. Yeah. He took me to his wow. hometown. Yeah, we literally gave each other tours of our hometown yeah. where we grew up. Oh like my everything. God. So That's cute. like the sweetest thing I've ever yeah. heard in my life. It's so cute. Like, and then I'm, soulmates, but friends. I'm really thankful for like his boyfriend too, because they kind of like sometimes I tell him like I feel like I'm like your guy's third. <laughs> they take me everywhere. That's yeah, right. Like, like they go to dinner, time. they'll invite me, and That's like in my head like. I sit there and I'm like, oh, they could be having this dinner alone. Mm-hmm. But they're like, Louie, do you want to come? And I'm like, like, it makes me sad. Happy. No, I, agree. I'm like, no, I, c- I literally am the exact. That's why I feel like I feel like we're so similar yeah. and like you guys are more similar. Yeah. Like, because mm-hmm. that's when I my Laura, I'm like, I was cry laughing when I hung out with Laura. And I was yeah. like, mm-hmm. we're going to be bonded for life. Yeah. Yes. And here we are. Yeah, you know, we it's are. been like six, seven years. Yep. Oh, I love that. Since yep. then, we've been through literally hell and high water together. <laughs> trauma yeah. bond. Trauma, trauma bond. I'm like, baby, you're my friend for life. We're yeah. 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 So I feel like it's like that. Like, same with her. Like, they'll, yeah. they'll be like going to movies. They're like, oh, do you want to come with us? We're going. Mm-hmm. I'm like, the movies. Yeah, I would love to yeah. come. Yeah. Yeah. Like, especially if I'm doing nothing in my house. Yes, like, it's nice to feel like. Well, Ty and it's like, and I'm sure your man is like developed a friendship with Louie too. So, like, Ty's developed a friendship with yeah Manny i shit on tyler all the time oh. that's me <laughs> i like yeah. clown tyler all the time and i just like comes from Manny like, hard he i comes think it me. on to him i'm like that sounded a little homophobic <laughs> <laughs> that was a little <laughs> that was rude no, 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 no manny holds his own just no i do manny i will cover her back no, yeah. Yeah. so it's, it's just but that that's how like you should love too. Yeah, yeah. totally. Like, whenever you're that close, like yeah. if I can clown you like well, that, I'm like, I like you. That's, that's, that's why I read you guys right now. I'm yes. like, I like you guys. Yes. If I read yes. you, I like you. Yeah. Yes. No, that's literally kind of how kind of how you show like love. Because mm-hmm. exactly. that's us with um my sister's boyfriend. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. Oh my god, we cab on him so hard, but he does the same thing <laughs> yeah, to yeah. us. It's like, nice. So I it's love like, that. I feel like people who don't get it from the outside, they're gonna be like, oh, like big. Yeah. Like, like, we see it, we're just cracking up. Because you're closer, you know each other well enough to do it. And I feel like it's also like maybe like a straight and gay bond. Yes. It's like yeah, a, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Like, it's like a yeah. brother and fun. sister vibe. Yes. Yeah, yes. yeah totally. Like my sibling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? No, I love that. Okay, so Louis, you're OG YouTuber. How long ago did you start? Uh-huh. Um, I started in 2014. I started in 2012. Oh, you were 13. 2013. You are a youngster. You're a little baby. Baby. Yeah, I started okay. In 2020. Oh shit! The COVID explosion. Yeah, what made literally. you? Okay, first of all, you guys have such a different dynamic because, like, I mean, mm-hmm. you guys came up so in vastly different ways. Differently. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No, oh, literally, huh? I feel like mine was a little bit more. It was definitely luck because, like, I feel like TikTok and, 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 and your talent. No, yeah. it was smart, smart enough but then to I do took it and I, I, I ran with it. See, I yes. like that. So I, I agree. Okay. I like, it's like, like you have to be smart to do that. But you were smart enough to develop this character. You're talented enough to play around. Yeah. Like so, I knew. I knew. I was like, I knew that because, like I said, I used to watch everybody that I like hang out with or I've talked to before. I used to watch all of them. 
So I knew being on the internet was like a career. I knew I was in. So you yeah. you can make it. Yeah. So yeah. What, what made you develop this character? Because like she was kind of like the first of her kind in a way. Yeah. Like no one yeah. carried it through. Like yeah. That. Like it, or it was like a one video and done. done. Yeah. You were like, oh, this is a persona. Had, like, little things. And it was like so done. People even on. like thought she was like <laughs> real. <and> yes. Like, <laughs> no, literally. Was really I really thought it was real for a second too. No, I'm literally. like, that's my, that's my cousin. Yeah. Uh -huh. That's my prima. The lash no, told me it was a character. The lash, yeah. the lash told me it was like, hey, yeah. imagine you walk in. Yeah. Yeah. No, sometimes when I go out in public, like they'll be like, where's the lash? I'm like, at home. Yeah. They're like, where's the contour? Yeah. Oh shit, the contour, the contour. Yeah. So, I feel like, so the video that I first ever did, it was literally just for my friends. TikTok was mm -hmm. just like, I was trying to be a makeup girly on, oh, on TikTok. Really? One of my first very like TikTok videos were fucking me doing glam. Yeah. yeah. So I was like, I love yeah. that. so whenever my Rosa video popped up, I was like, oh my God, did one of my makeup looks do its thing, bitch? <laughs> it was Rosa. It was Rosa laughing at me. So I didn't even have my notifications for TikTok turned on. I was wow. getting followers on Instagram and I was like, <gasps> cover girl. <laughs> Yeah. So then I look and I was like, oh my God, my Rosa video had like 200,000 views. And I was wow. like, oh shit. You're like, this is a start. So what was it like kind of blowing up? So you're like, let me try to do this again. Yeah, like, I remember to... it like, I think when it hit the million view mark, I was like, oh my God, like that was insane to me. Mm -hmm. So I went to, I was like working like a, at a bank. I went work, I went to work the next day and one of my coworkers was like, bitch, I saw. Oh, and and I, I had conversations with that coworker all the time about like being a YouTuber, like you know, mm -hmm. doing social media full time. And I was like, what do I do? He's like, are you telling me you're not, no, you don't know what to do after we talk about this all the fucking Aww. time. Right. And I was like, you're right, you're right. So like, I went home that day. My first video, Rosa didn't have a name. So I went home that day and I created a whole name for her. I added oh, the you were contour. smart about it. I love like, that. You planned it, it out. Like, like you like mine. took it. Yeah. Took advantage That's of it. That's really amazing that. that you did that. What like, was the first one? Like what was the first video that took up? Like what was the thing? What was she doing? My favorite. It's my favorite. Whoa, which <laughs> one is it? Um, Rosa's like, what'd you get for Christmas? <laughs> She's like, I got a new highlight. <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly. What you're talking about. And you had like a little candy cane. Yeah. yeah. I didn't even have lashes on. Oh no, wait. I didn't have a contour. I just okay. had a highlight and a mm. lash. And the lashes were put on right yeah. at first. Okay. So. Just a little okay. wonky, but it wasn't upside down yet. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that developed God. later on. So I feel like, yeah, it's like people at first thought he, it was like a real person. Uh -huh. that makes because sense. it didn't start off like upside yeah. down. It was subtle. Yeah. It was so subtle. people were like, who is this bitch? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. They're like, I've seen her before. <laughs> <laughs> like, she's in my yeah. class. I, like, didn't uh, even I know, know Rosa. Like, I genuinely didn't know Rosa was like worldwide like that. Wow. Like, whenever, oh, yeah. like, like Mm -hmm. It was just crazy. Your sounds also trended. Um, you fucking yeah. looking at me, dude? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. I, I had known, like, it was everywhere whenever people, like, all over the world were, like, quoting me. People in, like, I, there was a video that went viral one time of the entire high school was like, dude, come here. And I was like, how is a whole graduating class of 2019 saying my quote right now? Absolutely. That's all I heard. Crazy. That's so cool, though. How yeah. did you? How did you start? Start so, so long. Um, I started <laughs> at a really young age. Had but that's to be. because right, I've always been into like, too. I started at what? Uh, four, 15 years old. Wow. I was 15. We just had Tana on. She started at 15. 15 so. <gasps> yeah, I remember. Mm -hmm. But it's like crazy because... When I was doing it, I didn't really know YouTube was like a thing. I've just always been like, well, back up then it wasn't. Right? It was just kind of like, it's there. Yeah, same for me. Right? So you just like, it was for fun. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then and I was like hoping I could make like yes. 25 bucks off my AdSense. Oh, right. like, you know what I mean? It yeah. was. I didn't even know like AdSense was a thing until like fucking years later. But. Mm -hmm. I was making videos, just uploading, and then it just shit started blowing up. What I were you uploading? Funny shit or? It was shit, random or? ass videos. Okay. It was just me like, Living? I guess you can call them vlogs now. Mm. Yeah. But it was just me with my friends like playing and then after I deleted all those. So if you go to my channel now, it'll start in 2015. Got yeah, it, and that's got when it, I started it. taking it a little serious. So I would like oh. vlog in school and I would like yeah. just say like I bet you're funny really things. funny. Yeah, I was gonna uh, say, I bet you're really funny Yeah, I just, And like entertaining. Yeah, you know yeah. my energy was still very like, like my first video was still serious. You have to have energy to make it on YouTube. Yeah, and it, just help me out. And the first video of mine that like popped off was like a story time video. That was when like Tana was like really big as well. Yeah, the story time. Yeah, so I did a losing my virginity in sixth grade story time. <laughs> that one popped off and I gained, I think I had like 20K subscribers and I went up to 100K in like a night. <sighs> Oh my and god! I was like, oh, that's what YouTube used to it do. Was, though. It was, yeah, that's what it was. It was. wasn't like there was no TikTok, so that was yeah. like that was like the fucking. The it had the power. Like yeah. you had to be a big on YouTube to make it. Like yes. that was, and now it's TikTok yep. more so. Like to make it, like you have to be. Big and it was on like TikTok. the bigger following was on YouTube, yes. and then yes. it would like go everywhere else. Yeah, yes. but that was like my first one, and then from there I had another like. Really
really big. I think this one was like my biggest viral video was like um, how to dance at quinceañeras. And yeah. that's where I feel like I found my audience. I was the most yeah. comfortable. I started mm-hmm. making like all the content I wanted to make. And wow. yeah, so that's just kind of like how I started. And then I just started branching out to all the platforms. And it's like, like you said, it's crazy seeing like the community of like social media grow so much as well. Mm-hmm. And like, so there's so many more creators now. Like, I feel like if it wasn't for TikTok, like I would have met someone like Adam. For yeah. sure. So, so many different people, different humor and like just different ideas. Yeah. And it just feels like fresh. I was going to say, I feel Absolutely. like our relationship too, it also consists of us working together. Yeah. Totally. So yeah. I feel like because he's so OG and because I'm so new, he'll teach me things that I didn't even know about YouTube mm. or like social media or like brands. And, and like, if I know something new, like on TikTok, I'll be like, oh, did you know he this? He puts me on or even yeah. like all these mm-hmm. other platforms. Like, I guess so Snapchat is like coming back as well right oh, now. Right. He it put is. me on like how to... Bitch, I don't even know how to use Snapchat anymore. Girl, right? I was Hello. trying to figure out the other day how to add music to my Snapchat. <laughs> yes. Yeah. I was, I was just so like, because it went away for so long. Yeah, uh-huh. He literally just showed me. So I was like yeah. on my Snapchat trying to read like when people reply to your thing. And he's like, you know, there's like a, a notification button right there. Yeah. And I was like, oh shit, I don't know that. I literally don't know. Yeah. And well, we like, got, we were at Coachella and we we're like, why is it? Because like people oh God, will ask so to take right. pictures with us. And we were like, why is everybody that's asks to take pictures of us with us pulling up their Snapchat to take the picture? Yeah, it's all Snapchat. So yeah. me and Mandy were like, wait a minute. Is this coming back? And the Snapchat yes. filters are elite. Yeah, oh, very yes. Yes. Yep. Yes. They're like the yes. OG. Instagram yes. is just puffy as libs and you're like, it's trying to make your lips yes. too big. Yes. I'm like, I'm yes. not it's like Some of them will like pull your whole face. Yes. 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 So yes. natural. Yeah. 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 I'm, like, okay. I'm like, I need a little something, but yes, Jesus like Christ. That. I was shocked about the Snapchat thing. I was like, oh, I didn't know it was like, yeah, no, it was like, get the dust off that app. No, but like now that like I'm on it and it works, I feel like it makes so much sense. I'm like, why did I like ever? I mean, it died off for it. Did. Totally. It did. It died off. But people are really on there to just watch your stories. It's yep. not like Instagram. People are like, like I don't want to see the story. Reels, right. like, yes. All the other shit. On Snapchat, it's just Snapchat. And they have like their own version of like Reels, I guess, or yeah. something. Right. Yeah. But it's like they Snapchat like people want to see uh, what you just have to say on there. And it's yeah. really cool. But I feel like Snapchat and YouTube have that same role of like people are watching you because they genuinely want to watch like you. you. And they like long form and they like just your personality. So I feel mm-hmm. like that's where we can be like, more of ourselves yeah so yes that. yes me too I've, that's always, that's more like, I've never been like the ig baddie type of girl which i've mm. always felt a little mess place in beauty like because that's like majority of what beauty is is like ig baddies IG, and yeah. my stuff is more catered toward like humor and like yes. just Same. having fun and yeah, being yeah, stupid yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. so I, that's why I've always like, honestly be a, a more of a YouTube girly because mm-hmm. you know that's like a different like it's not a filtered out like if you're on YouTube yes. like they know you yeah, yeah. like they it's see you they you. know yeah. you yeah. Yeah. clothes and but good TikTok's as lighting like that now too yes, there's like a I baddie section on TikTok mm-hmm. for like people to slay but like a majority of TikTok is like realness or yes. people being stupid or yeah. having that's fun that's all these conversations that's, yeah it's conversations it's like more real yeah. oh my god it's like I've more that some sort of pop Yes. Oh and it, it makes you feel like uh-huh. it's almost like YouTube. You're yeah. Like, oh my God, this, and it's so much quicker. So you're like, oh wow, like it's yeah. easier, Easy. but it makes me sad because like I know Google's hurting. I'm like, don't even want to say this on this. I'm like, I know Google, <laughs> I know you're hurting. But um they are, and it makes yeah. me so sad because it's such a strong long form is such a strong platform. I hate to see it. Suffer. It's just weird that it's going somewhere else. So like TikTok is becoming longer form because yeah. you upload it for 10 minutes. It is. And it's just like going in a in it's a different like, place. It's so strange. They're all in the same I'm like, why is it like just a revolving door? Yeah, it is. it's just a different it app because TikTok's newer, so it's like, oh, let's just go there. Yeah, it's, like, it's just the same thing. Like yeah, I low key, the they're all the same, same thing, but it's just like what's what, what's where everyone's at right now. We're like yes. cutting the potato in different ways. Yes. It's all I'm just like, a yeah. fucking potato. Yes, is that we're all hungry? We're all hungry. I'm like, what the fuck? I know. Do you do YouTube? Yeah. Oh shit. Yeah. I was able to like. Yeah, I was able to like. Um, transition, transition to over. like different platforms. Well, you were early on TikTok. Yeah, yeah. I, that's why I feel like I was in the very Smart. early stages of Smart. it. So yeah. everybody was like, "Wait, what's going on? Like, who are yeah. these new people?" Yeah. yeah. So I was able to even grow on Instagram. I have a following. Oh, like, a huge following. Yeah. 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 No, Thank everyone God. knows who you are for sure. I know it's like TikTok. Like it was like in 2020, there was a lot of like you, Addison, right? Like we get Charlie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got yeah. it, like core people. Yes. Mm-hmm. They got kind of infamous from it. Brittany yeah. Broski. Brittany Broski. Oh, yeah. Like oh, yeah. They got like ones. infamous from the app, and mm-hmm. I do feel like now people are still becoming infamous from it. Like not Alex Earl, I think, but not as much because it's so saturated yeah. now. Yes. At the beginning, it was like those girlies, girlies yeah. like made the name. Yeah, yeah, and like yeah. now on YouTube, you don't see as many people like become infamous. Like, oh, this girl's yes. coming up on mm-hmm. YouTube. You like, don't see yeah. that. But I do feel like YouTube it has it's gonna have like a huge like. I, I agree. They're predicting I it. Why. They are predicting it. Mm-hmm. I saw like 
people that forecast like yeah, yeah. what's coming and yeah. they think like TikTok is going to get to long form and get yes. obsessed with the long form of TikTok and then it's going to go back to YouTube. Yes, like it's going to direct. Yes, and, like, I feel it that. It literally that. is what like people are watching. Yeah. Like people don't even yeah. have cable anymore. I know. People only know. are on social media and like if people and like even streaming services like yeah. You can watch yeah. everything on fucking YouTube. On YouTube. And YouTube TV. Like, yeah. they, like they yeah. implement these things that are super oh, yeah. smart YouTube that are like, it's so weird. yeah, the like TV they shows, originals. The originals. Like yeah. they have so much to offer. And it's like, damn, I don't know any other platform that has like that much yeah. to offer. That's why I don't think they'll ever go away. Oh my I God. I really don't. Well, like, YouTube's yeah, YouTube will Google always be and Google that typically bitch. buys out any competitor. So <sighs> true. It's hard for them to go away. It's true. Okay. What is like something on social media that's like one of your favorite things about it? And what's something about social media that you effing hate? I can start. All right. <laughs> there there go. Go. He's like, no, I think one of my favorite things is being able to find a community that understands me, mm. my humor, my the way I dress, everything. Like I will go on there and it's like my own world. It it's like, oh, like I see my comments. Yes. Yeah, I'm like, mm-hmm. those are my perras. They understand me. They know the vibe. So I feel the most like Same. welcome, accepted, mm-hmm. happiest. But then there's the other side Girl. where it's like. It's literally the same thing. It's like outside the the trenches. Yes. It's like it could also be the fucking worst thing ever. And I feel like I I, like I always see those comments and like I get it, but I don't. Those people who are like, well, you chose to be on social media. So like you owe us everything. And that's what scares me because I'm like, fuck, like it's amazing and it's beautiful. But then it's like sometimes people feel like they have full power over you and you're Mm -hmm. like a little puppet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I think that's when it gets scary. But I don't think it's like our genuine viewers. It's the people who are like either trolls or just mm-hmm. people looking out but it's mm-hmm. like that's the ugly side of it and it like totally. really does suck so it's literally like just the flip it's scary what about you anna um i feel like the uh, the one thing that i love is that the power that social media has to change someone's life mm-hmm. like overnight oh, yeah. Yeah. is it incredible it's and we used to didn't have that like if you didn't have a connection network or yes, money you were shit you out of luck yeah, you were never too. gonna or make you didn't it go to college. or if you didn't go to college yeah. or you didn't have an agent like you yes. were screwed yeah. mm-hmm. oh my god like literally, literally change someone's life completely and like and they don't even like just being themselves or like doing what they love and, and it's crazy um but one thing that i hate uh no. He's like, I, I, I love it all. I don't like, hate it. All. No, I mean, it all. I would I get agree it. with Lily on that part. It. Like, just sometimes the hate that you get can be a little overwhelming. Yeah. yeah, you just don't know what to do with it. So that's the one thing that, like, I even have myself have taken like several breaks off of the internet because mm-hmm. of some of the hate that I've received, and I'm like, mm-hmm. I can't. Like, I'm I'm still yeah. a human being. Yeah, like, people just don't understand. I think I talked about this with yeah. Adam that and I. Your crier. <laughs> <laughs> but I asked him, I was like, okay, I want to know. Because he was telling me how, like, even before he started doing social media, he, like, always, like, manifested. He's like, I want to, like, be an influencer. I want to be online, whatever. Mm-hmm. So then I was like, how was that, like, transition for you of, like, living in your own little world, making fun videos for yourself and your friends? And then when he literally popped off being Rosa, he also mentioned he got, like, a lot of hate. Mm-hmm. And he was just like, it was just scary. Like, yeah. it's just you, you get all this love. But then I, I feel like you don't. People don't understand how bad it is until you're in it. Mm-hmm. That people are like, sometimes people are like, I wouldn't give a fuck. Like, blah, blah. It's really easy to say that, but then you're but in when it. It's, it's about like, you. you. Yeah. yeah. Reading like, about someone else, saying about someone else yeah. doesn't bother you're you. Like, so oh, you no. don't think it would bother you, but yes. wait till it's about it you. It's so yeah. personal. There was yeah. times where I literally would have nightmares, like yeah. waking up, like sweating and like almost at the verge of tears because I like had nightmares of people bullying me online. And I was like, mm-hmm. why is this happening? Like, it was just scary. Yeah. 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 So you're kind of like forced to like, Figure out how to yeah. do it. You just have totally. to, yeah, honestly, like you just become like it it's sounds a powerful sad, but you get tool. Used to it. It's a powerful tool say, to yeah. have in your head, being mm-hmm. able to take that, yes, and, like being able to navigate it. it. It's mm-hmm. like such a powerful life tool to have, which which hopefully no one should have yeah. because my God. That's but so I mean, especially whenever your shit gets put out on the for you page, you're like, oh here we go. No, I will avoid comment sections all the time. Oh yes. Oh yeah. Anytime a video of me like like randomly pops up, I'm like, uh, I'm not reading those comments. Literally, literally. Oh, I know what my stuff. I know what my stuff says the for you i'm like yeah <laughs> these are no longer my people well, have you guys ever done 100%. branded content and they push oh, it out uh-huh. like Big. and i'm like Oh it'll my God. it'll have oh my like please. so many views with like 10k likes. Yeah. Like, so many comments yeah. just reading you. Like, why would you ever work with him? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, like, I'm like, thank you. Thank I you for know. that. Thank you. But especially so much. when we're like super femme on there like, oh my and, like the straights God. get to it or something I, I it's not like it. a makeup thing or it's like a cash app thing or like trying to <gasps> <laughs> like no but I know all too well I feel you it's like I'm putting on my own blood, my own ad on my <laughs> own <laughs> no even okay, do you guys use Facebook 
Face app. Facebook. I just started, I just we're using sure don't, Snack. Sure don't. And they're okay, doing it for me. Oh, yeah. yes, yes, yes. That's so for me. there is where they Facebook will literally scary. eat me up <laughs> and chew. Like, Facebook is scary for yeah. me, so I can't even imagine. Yeah, like, it's crazy. I won't look at it. Like, brands will, like, put our stuff on there. Oh, oh my and God. And it's not even, because it's obviously not us putting it, but, like, we'll be tired right. or whatever. Right. And I look at the comments and I'm like, oh. It's like I'm, way older people with really yeah, like I was gonna say very no open mind yes. thoughts. Like yeah. very the minds are closed. Yes. Yes. The minds yes. are closed. Yes. The most Sometimes closed. Yeah. I will look at a comment and I will laugh <laughs> because I'm like, bitch, why would you write that out? Like, yeah, yeah, like are somebody, you good? Yeah, yeah, like the weirdest, most vile shit I've ever. Yeah. And then you look at their Facebook. profile picture and it's more shocking seeing like there's so we much have a love love yes. Yeah, yeah. Like hatred here. Like mom God's of love. three. God's love in our house. God's yeah. love. I'm like, okay. I'm like y'all the most hateful though. Yeah, it's the literally. most hateful no, bitches. One time. <laughs> no, 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 no. I say love it. when you do that. Yeah. Yeah. I I you know it's gonna be good. Like, it's because okay, so this guy came for me so hard. Like he was calling me the most. Like I wasn't even a human to him. Wow. Yeah. So just I went to his profile. <laughs> just a hole. Just a hole. I went to his profile and he was he had just been recovering from a stroke. <laughs> so I was like, Adam, oh, you're like, Adam, you're out here doing this. I know, I'm Adam. You took the bait, didn't you? I was like, you need to be focusing on recovery <laughs> and not bullying me right now. No, so, literally, right? I'm like, baby, this that's probably what got you in there. I like, know, girl. All yes. the hatred, yes. yeah, all the hatred, <laughs> the brujeria. Yeah, he like put himself in there. Yes, <laughs> that's scary. But, Honestly, and he was like coming to me you, like girl. so ruthless. I was like, yeah. why are you? Or like, that's why oh. he was doing this. He was so. Frustrated with his own life. Yes. A lot of times but people girl, are frustrated with their own life. That is life, no excuse it. for that yes. behavior. It's not an excuse. It may be a why, but it's but not it's, an it's excuse. It's not an excuse. It definitely like, could be a reason. Yeah. I was going to say, too, never in my life, even before social media, would I ever write out a hate comment oh, and send God. it. Like, uh, my energy is just not for that. Like, no, same. Well, that's why it's you're weird. at where you're at today. You know what I mean? Yeah. Exactly. Question with you. So you're having surgery soon in a few yeah. weeks. So what is the surgery exactly that you're getting? So I had a... Florida Lee tummy tuck for my skin removal back in 2021 of December. Uh -huh. I remember seeing so, that. Yeah, I basically this one I'm getting is the rest of the skin that wasn't removed from wow. my first one is getting all taken. Off. Oh my god! No way! Okay. So, so yeah, there yeah. you go. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's so fascinating to me. So I'm like, so the first one they didn't take it. Off. Why did they take it all the first time? Too much, sir. Like, yeah, too dangerous. Did, uh, like safety. Oh, yeah, you okay, can't, okay. Like a crazy. lot of like, because even with my first one, I had to be hunched over. Oh, okay. so in order for me to for this one, I can't be hunched over. I have to be straight. I have to like oh, okay. you know, my posture. What is, is like, recovery? Is it like pretty um, extensive? It's, yeah, it's like two months. Holy oh my God. crap! Because I'm doing I'm doing Holy an upper spirit. body lift, so I'm literally getting everything that's loose here uh -huh. plus my arms. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I literally am gonna be like beep. beep. Uh, okay. so yeah. like, what like? And can you not move when that happens? Like, how uh, is it? Like I mean, I, I can. They recommend to like keep moving, so like blood clots. Oh, and the stuff flows. Like that. Yeah. So, but I can't be like fatty, fat, like fucking yeah. like, right. every day. Like, I can still like you know walk around the house wow. and like go grocery wow. shopping, but like I can't like do like crazy activities. You're really young, so that's really good because I'm sure yeah. your body, body will bounce just, back. Like, that's so what my strong. doctor told me. I'm yes. super excited because like. I feel like I'm at the point in my life where I'm still so young, getting you the are. surgery, I'm still gonna get so much yeah. out of it. Like, oh, so oh my much. God. And yes. I'm so excited. Yes. And, and Cause like, I feel like this is like a, a step in my weight loss journey that's gonna actually like show what I've been able to accomplish. Yeah. And it's gonna just be so You're gonna like feel rewarding. Really good. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure you already ha do oh, from yeah. how like where yeah. you come. Yeah, like, no, for sure. And so when you, when you, did you start it with like just going onto a diet and diet and working out, or did you start off no. with like surgery? Did you? How did I, so you for start? the longest, longest time, I had always tried. Like I've, I've always been unhealthy. Like growing mm. up, I was always like the like the little fat boy, or like I was just mm. super unhealthy, and my eating habits were really bad. So I would literally go to several doctors' appointments all the time and be told mm. the same thing every single time. Like if you don't fix it, like this is gonna happen. Like you have like, and my family too. My family history has like a history with diabetes, high yeah. cholesterol, high blood pressure, and all that. So I ended up like because I wasn't able to do it on my own, I ended up getting like gastric bypass. So that is what like gave oh, me mm -hmm. that like the little, jolt. Like, uh -huh. So mm -hmm. I was like luckily and like blessed enough to get that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that's when I now I'm lost. Like, like over changed your life. Whoa, wow. Yeah. That's amazing. That literally yeah. changed. It, life no, I, 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 I thank that thing all the time because like I was at my lowest point I had ever been. At, I, I don't even know how I was able to like survive that whole thing because wow. it was just like a dark place for me physically and mm -hmm. mentally mm -hmm. it was just like a whole like that's why i call it like it's a, a journey like this entire yeah. thing for me 
So I feel like it like saved my life. Oh my god, I'm gonna cry. <laughs> That's amazing. Oh god, that That's is really amazing. amazing. Yeah. Oh my god, what a journey. Yeah, literally. Okay, for our last question, and we ask every single guest that comes on full cover this question: If you guys each got a billion dollars in cash, mm. tax free, oh. what are you gonna do with it? We don't care about charity. Don't even say it. <laughs> what are you gonna, <laughs> gonna donate to charity? But You're like, gonna donate to charity. Would you give to your, yourself? Now, what would you spoil yourself for with? myself? For Yourself. Billion dollars cash. What's the big Fuck. prize? Okay, I probably Spill it. buy like a shit ton of land. Yeah, that, oh. was, that was what I was gonna go for. Oh. And create like an Addy's world. Oh, oh, like, yes, all yes. the stuff you yeah, love. Literally, like I don't even have to like leave my house for anything. Oh, I even have God. a little McDonald's in there for me. Yeah, so I'm just like, let me walk to McDonald's. <laughs> I love I'm that. Obsessed. It's like similar. I would love to just buy like a huge house. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Not only for me, but for my family. Because yeah. they make me happy. Mm-hmm. And like a house where I could just like have friends over, make it like a fun type like a of like thing. Yeah. 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 And then In I would a probably, state. Yeah. And I would probably have so many fucking dogs. I love Dude, dogs. Yeah. <laughs> so I feel like I would just like, I would love to run and just have a bunch of fucking dogs. Do you have dogs now? I do. I, ha- I have two. Oh, I do you have any pets? Yes. No, I don't. I have cats, so. I'm you know what? Cats. <gasps> Are uh, you? Oh, yeah, you did tell me. They'll get you. No, girl. Before, so my younger sister has a cat. His name's Jasper. Before Love. Jasper, I didn't Love. like cats. <gasps> See, I was cats just are like. nice, though. Do you like. Do- now. Jasper's really the only cat that I've been around and yeah. I love him. Like yeah. I love cuddling him. That means him. you're an animal lover. Though. Yeah. Animals. I'm the same way. It's just because I love, I was drawn to dogs because dogs are so hyper. They're so, they want to play with them. They want to have attention. attention. Mm-hmm. Like anyone who like knows me and like my dog, honey, they know how like our bond is like this. Like uh, she's yeah. copy. Like that's I'm like, your baby. sometimes I'm like, ew, you're me. Like in a dog. Like that's <laughs> literally us. Mood, mood, <laughs> like mood. we're the same thing. But yeah. When I met a cat, well, when I met a cat, I was like, <laughs> no, no, no. when I thought of a cat, I never thought I could ever have like a relationship with a cat. Right. And then I met my sister's cat and then I'm like, oh my God, I'm so in love with They're different. Jasper. They're very They're different. different. They're independent. They love their own space. They do. But once they want love, they'll come up to you. Oh, They're that love playful. is so special though. It, it, it's like, rewarding. It yeah. Is. Because you know they're so independent that oh, when they yeah. look for you and they're like, okay, pet it's me, I'm they like, want yeah. you want you, me. They yeah. want to you love, love you. And they love you and they're yes. showing you that and you know that because yes. my cats all cats they're literally like this half the time yes they're and very if you independent touch them, they'll just kind of get up and walk yes oh, they're, they're all like, bbl girls yeah. 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 <laughs> I'm like, Shut yeah. Up. Okay, so yeah, I'm I'm a cat lover. Many a little. I have a little dog as well. So yeah. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah, but I like I love cats. Like I love all animals. Like I'm mm. a huge just animal Same. person. I like, like dogs. Like I like, yeah, dogs, I like dogs for too. sure. I'm hesitant on having one because I like low maintenance. Yes. I'm just oh, yeah, like yeah. so low maintenance. Cats will do their own thing. They do yeah. everything. So they, they do live. their laundry. Yeah. They do yeah. Yeah. Everything. Yeah. everything. Yes. No, I've turned Gabriel Zamora into a cat lady. And he is. He loves it. He's a cat boy. Oh, I love it. Well, well thank you guys. It. That was it. That was it for the episode. That was so much fun. Oh my God. Thank you guys for having us. Oh, we went through a two. journey through here. I know. Oh, it's like everything we just talked about <laughs> right now. Literally. Like, I'm all blacked out. I'm like, what are you oh, really oh, blacked out? It's three, it's three days later. <laughs> I know. <laughs> for real, you wake up like, no. guys. <laughs> when you hear yeah. I know, no, no, the story when you fell asleep on the chair, that, that really, I out. was, I didn't think I was going to recover from that uh, after. Is that like, yeah. Louis? <laughs> no, he, <laughs> like, really <laughs> killed me personally. <laughs> that was so good. But thank you so much for coming. I'm yes. going to leave, of course, all their socials linked down, down below. below. You guys check them out. Yay. And we will see you guys in the next episode of Full Coverage. Thank Bye. you guys so much. Bye. Bye. Bye.